or not? Today, we are looking at the Hasbro Marvel Legends Angela, part of the 2017 Guardians of the Galaxy Titus Build a Figure Wave. A big thank you to Rambling Rob for my new intro. I find his channel very helpful, especially in terms of the reading order of comic book events. Please check out his channel and subscribe. Back in 2017, this was the Hasbro packaging, wherein there is a window where you can see the figure and at the back there is a short read up about the character. Art on both left and right sides. Here we can see all the accessories that comes with the figure. So two axe like objects and a sword and one of the legs of the Titus build the figure. Angela is the fan favorite winner for 2017. This is a good looking figure with so much details. I mean everything is sculpted in terms of the armor that she has. The belt is a separate piece and you can see even her boots, her very high boots, it's all sculpted and with golden metallic paint. A very well done figure as you can see from the back even the details of how her costume is attached to her is shown she comes with a place to put her sword which is attached to the brown belt and even on the back they gave so much details with the paint and the sculpt work so this is a really well done figure which we rarely see nowadays and you can see here now I can attach the sword there and since she comes with two weapon holding hands she can hold both axe. This figure does not look like a Marvel Legends especially in terms of how she wear her two piece costume. As you can see she is well defined in terms of the female shape matching how she is drawn in the comic book. Angela's first comic book appearance is in Image Comics Spawn No. 9 published March 1993. She is created by author Neil Gaiman and artist Todd McFarlane. The legal rights to the character became a part of a legal battle between Todd McFarlane and Neil Gaiman. Neil Gaiman won the battle and sold the rights to this character to Marvel Comics. Angela made her first appearance in the story Age of Ultron in 2013. She joined the Guardians of the Galaxy and later in the storyline Original Sin, it was revealed that she is the lost sister of Thor. Here in the side-by-side -side photo from Image Comics and Marvel Comics, you can see that Angela retained most of her costume details. A quick look on the articulation, you can see she has single jointed elbow and double jointed knees with pins. The pins are in the same color as her boot so it doesn't really bother me that much. She can kick that far. Her feet can hinge forward and back and she has a upper torso swivel. She cannot look up that much because of her hair. In terms of her weapons, which is the sword and the axe, it is not a big surprise that five years later, Hasbro used the same weapons for Spiral but of a different paint or plastic color. The figure stands 17 centimeters or 6.7 inch tall. According to Marvel.com, Angela is 6 feet 2 inches. Here she is besides Wolverine and Deadpool and Hitmonkey. Next we have her besides Separate Cuckoos and Black Cat. Next up we have her besides the Renew Your Bows 2 pack, Spider Man and Spinneret. Next we have her besides Thunderbolts, Satana and Moonstone. Next we have her besides Crossbones and Tundra. Next, we have her besides larger Vilda figure, Wendigo, and the Retro Rhino. Next up, we have her besides 7-inch scale figures from Marvel Select, 
we have Hulk, Sabretooth, and Colossus. The Good. She is a comic book accurate representation of the character Angela. The Bad. She doesn't come with any alternate hands. However, this can be easily overlooked because she does not look like a regular Marvel Legends figure. She is not toned down or made PG and is similar to the figures created by the loose collector. I doubt that going forward we will ever get a figure with this kind of design. It was communicated loud and clear by Hasbro during the recent Haslab Hell Charger Ghost Rider campaign that we should expect a toned down or PG version of our favorite comic book characters. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please take a look at my other videos in this channel. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, and ring the notification bell.